Welcome back, everybody. This is Derek Kirby for Blogging the Boys, and we are back with another Madden simulation here. This time, we're taking a look at the Cowboys' Week 2 matchup against the Philadelphia Eagles. This is the Cowboys' home opener this season. As always, we've tried to make the necessary adjustments to the depth chart. Guys that are injured or on the COVID slash reserve list, we've taken them out of the lineup. There's a couple minor adjustments in there guys who are still as of the recording of this unclear whether they will play but we've made the adjustments that we can anticipate and we're going to see how this rolls now last week the simulation was i mean obviously it had the chargers winning and that sucked but the good news is the cowboys actually won the game so let's see how dak do oh my god all right dak prescott throws a pick on the cowboys first drive Eagles have it basically at the Dallas 30. Well, that was that was quick. Bad start for the Cowboys here. Jalen Hurts out of the shotgun at the 30. Drops down to Sanders, and you get a, a tackle for a short gain. Basically, the line of scrimmage here looks like by Jordan Lewis. Very good open field tackle there from Jordan Lewis. That is not the frame of Jordan Lewis, though, so it took a second to realize that's who it was. Good play here from the defense. It looks like they're going to hold the Eagles to a field goal. Yep, Eagles on the board first, 3-0. That's a good stand by the defense, considering the offense gave them the ball at the Dallas 32, I want to say. That's a really good stand by the Cowboys defense. Cowboys come up dry on the next possession as well, and Sanders has the Eagles rolling. This carry here and the carry before, which you didn't see, result in 30 quick yards. And, oh, is that a touchdown? Devonta Smith looks like he gets into the end zone. I didn't think he got it, but Madden says he did. So, okay. Looks like we're looking at 9, about to be 10 nothing Philadelphia early in the second quarter here. That is not good for Dallas. Man, he did not get in. Where are his feet? No, I don't think he got in. What kind of rinky-dink simulation is this? I know Madden can be a little bit broken, but that seems egregious. All right, we're going to get a booth review. Overturn this sucker. There's no way. There is no way he was in the end zone. No, the ball never breaks the plane. That's the question, CD. What are they looking for? Not even close. If they uphold this, I'm ending the simulation right now. I'm just calling it. Okay, it is overturned, but... Oh, good play by... Oh, what the heck? Luke Gifford makes a great play in the backfield. He's got him stood up, and then Sanders just trucks over him. No, I'm sorry, is Dak Prescott flexing on the sideline? Not just one flex, two flexes on the sideline after an Eagles touchdown? What is happening? What is that throw? What what does Madden think Dak Prescott does? That is absolutely mental. And that, that gets the ball moving here. Dallas down to about the 35 of the Eagles now. So Dallas is driving. I man. I am still trying to process that Dak Prescott was flexing on the sideline after an Eagles touchdown to put it up 10 0. Especially when he'd already thrown a pick. Check down the uh, Ezekiel Elliott there and gets down to about the 13-yard line of Philadelphia. Dallas looks like they've got something going here. Dak is, oh my God, where, where, is, where are the instincts? By the way, that would absolutely be taunting. Where are the instincts from Dak Prescott in the Madden simulations? These plays are mental. There's no awareness. He would throw the ball away. He's losing like 12 yards on second and goal, and they're going to have to settle for a field goal. Okay. Well, Dallas does get on the board with a short field goal. It is 10 to 3 Philadelphia here. I'm not feeling too great about this. This is a little concerning to me. Dallas does get the ball back, though, and they are cooking. So right before the half, Dallas with a chance here. They're down to the five. Dak. Wide open there to Cedric Wilson for the touchdown. How about that for a quick turnaround? Dallas ties it up before the end of the half. That's really good momentum for the Cowboys there. Let's see if they can carry that over. 
Micah Parsons on third and one with a loss of four on the play. Tackle on Sanders in the open field. That is a heck of a play from your number one pick. Now, see, it makes sense for Dak to celebrate there. CeeDee Lamb with a nice gain there. On first and ten, CeeDee Lamb with a sizable gain. Let's see what he can do. Dak out of the shotgun, going to throw from the Dallas 46. He's going deep to Lamb. He's got him for a touchdown. Heck yes. Dallas is roaring back 17 unanswered points. 48 yards, 49 yards, something like that. And that is a heck of a play from C.D. Lamb. Back-to-back -back catches from C.D. Lamb take the Cowboys pretty much the length of the field, technically half the length, but whatever. Got him into the end zone. That's all that matters. Great play from C.D. Lamb there. The perennial Cowboys X-Factor. Jalen Hurts now has the Eagles responding at midfield. Oh, no. He's going deep. And, oh, right back. The Eagles come right back with a deep shot of their own. This one to Rager. 49 yards. Wow, it's basically the exact same play, Dallas. Not the same play, but the same result. A 49-yard touchdown strike to the number two receiver, basically. Wow. Where is the originality, Madden? Jalen Rager. All right. Well, we're nodded back up at 17 here. Jalen Hurts does have a reasonably good deep ball. We saw that last week for the Eagles, their 91-yard completion. Somehow got... What was that? Dalton Schultz. I think that was Schultz. That might have been Jarwin, but wide open. Dak misses, but the tight end never looks for the ball. What a baffling play. I almost wonder if the Madden simulation, like, didn't look at Dak's first five games last year to evaluate how good he is. Because through the first two weeks of simulations, I don't understand, and it's another easy miss. Dak has better accuracy than this. Cowboys are going to have to settle for another field goal. They do boot it through, so it is 20-17 to 17 Dallas leading now. Yeah, this is really weird. I don't understand why Dak's accuracy, his awareness... It's just not very high through the first two weeks of Madden simulation. Jalen Hurts going deep to, oh, Devonta Smith. What a catch. What a catch. 24, eh, okay, he's going through the Gatorade, the Gatorade cart. Why is McCarthy complaining to who I'm guessing is supposed to be Kellen Moore? Why is he complaining to the offensive coordinator about what the defense just gave up? This game makes no sense with its little animations and the overall presentation. All right. So Cowboys coming out here. They do. The defense does get a stop. The Cowboys are going to send out for a long field goal here for Zerline on their next drive. It's fourth and five. And wow. Wow, that was way short and way to the right. Man, look where he's kicking from. Okay, well, <laughs> I guess it's kind of week one in Tampa Bay again. Here's, oh no, oh no. A pick six from Dak with the three minute 30 second mark. Oh boy. This is a rough game for Dak Prescott. He has two touchdown passes, but he also has two really bad interceptions. And uh, oh my God, Dak eats another sack here. Ezekiel Elliott with the chop block. The defender has time to get up and still make a sack. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Is that, is that Dak Prescott on the sideline? No helmet, cup of water. On 4th and 14, where is my quarterback? What is this? What even is this? What is this Madden? This is madness. All right, here we are now on 4th and 14. Dak Prescott going deep down the right sideline for C.D. Lamb. And, oh, Lamb can't haul it in. It's a turnover on downs. Oh, man, it hits Lamb right in the hands. Defender does not get a hand on it. This is week one in Tampa Bay. C.D. Lamb... 
deflecting not good hands here man that is a that is baffling that is a disappointing loss for the cowboys they're going to take here unless the defense can get a stop and nope nope the eagles are going to kneel this one out all right well the eagles are going to take this 24 20 disappointing loss for dallas here and dak what are you doing dak what are you doing i mean it's not what are you doing cowboys fans would be losing their mind if in real life in that situation dak prescott was celebrating and yucking it up after a disappointing loss madden what is this? What have you done to Dak Prescott? This doesn't make any sense at all. Dak Prescott continually either animated in weird situations where he's on the sideline when he shouldn't be, either celebrating when the Eagles are the ones doing something good, or celebrating a loss and doing all these crazy poses on the, on the field with the opposing team after the game. What is this? The inaccuracy, the, the lack of awareness. Did Madden not look at last year's tape for Dak Prescott? Are they still looking at, like, bad Dak from 2017? Goodness. Oh, boy. All right, Cowboys 0-2 in our simulations. Let's hope it's like last week and the Cowboys are going to prove the simulation wrong and get a big win Monday night.